Redemption 2 again. So, oh, does it automatically load your last save or something? Uh, I think we're going to another battle yesterday. <laughs> so basically, my eyes are still improving, but my collarbone. Well, I mean, I'm collarbones also improving, but it still hurts. I still cannot do push up, basically. I mean, I can, but it starts to hurt if I do push up, so. Yeah. I really hope there's no permanent damage. I really hope, like, after after a week of rest, it is. Oh, it's so annoying when. All I did was, like, sleep. Yeah, I guess I sleep on the side, and then I guess the position just... I sleep like that for like more like two decades or something. And then that one night, I that position just, I guess, yeah, it gives press, put pressure directly on top of the collarbone for I a night and then, yeah, it just started to hurt. You're introducing him to your it just started to hurt. So, wait, photomo? What do you mean photomo? Damn, you can do that? Fuck. Wow. Wheel photos. Oh, okay. That's. Okay. I'll mind you to show me some respects, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You're still here then? Okay, we watched that yesterday, so. Who the hell is Levitus Corvo? Right, what? Items? What? How about my gun? Where, where's my gun? What? We're riding with the gang that would have to move up the formation. Easy. Oh. Listen up, all of you. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the O'Driscolls, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're gonna pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars. That's a lot of horse riding, though. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You yeah, I mean, Morgan, guess they don't want to. You keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough. I guess they don't want to make the cutscene too long. I think. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Because these can easily be a cutscene. These can easily be in a cutscene. You're just holding forward, basically, while they talk. So. Yeah, maybe they, they need law explanation and doesn't want to to do the casting for too long. So they alternate between casting and then the riding scene, I guess. Ah, oh, it's so frustrating when I just see. When I just sleep at like a wrong position one night and then my collarbone just start hurting for a week. I mean it's improving so it, it doesn't the joint doesn't pop anymore. I don't know if I need to go to see a doctor or something. If I don't know. 
It is improving, so I don't know. Just happy we're back at him, Dutch. You sure you're ready for this, kid? Of course I'm ready. Just stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No mistakes. Oh wow, he he even ducked so we his this. head. Then if, we go back if you to collect. How many times you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting If you go long. under a tree. That's a lot of details. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back. And that's the end of it. Money safe. You'll just have to trust me. And if the O'Driscolls are right, there'll be a stack of railroad bonds on this train. Good money once we work out how to cash them. Now everyone, shut up. Get your mind on the job at hand. Come on. Oh, there's the water tower. Hold up here on the ridge. Passing you. Yep. Whoa. There, boy. Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. Check on Bill. Do I just walk down or <laughs> you, you actually okay kind of makes sense are you supposed to be on your horse though? Cannot run, okay. Yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. Arthur is gonna do all the work. Okay, this is good. All right, that should do it. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. Can I steal your horse? I cannot even approach the horse. Wow. Yeah, it's interesting with the stamina and the health system. Like, if you're healthy, then you you get more stuff. So, weapon items. Oh. Oh. Okay. Interesting. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Do I have my gun? My rifle? I like the rifle. Well, basically, I like assault. I, I like rifles I so. more than handguns. Okay, so. cover your face. Train should be here any minute now. Uh, how do I do that? Hold have to show the weapon wheel. Oh, I was... Oh, okay. <laughs> Damn. 
attached to these guys. Gentlemen, it's time. <laughs> Something is going to go wrong. Something is going to go wrong. I know what to do. Either the bomb is not gonna explode or someone is gonna get hurt or something. Yeah, something is gonna go wrong. No, what? God! Oh, you have gotta be kidding me! Where did you find that moron? You said it was fine. It's my fault. Come on! You're pathetic. You know that? Wait, what are they? Oh, jump on the tree. Oh, okay. You let you need to like unhook. You need to like unhook the what? Oh, you just spam it, okay? You need to unhook the train. Do you have time <laughs> limits? Actually, wait, nothing here. Should we move up? Yeah, we're robbery anyway, so you cannot even take. Why? Oh, you cannot carry more. These are uh, oils. Snake oil. Oh. Alright, we can move up. Oh, you okay? I don't want to actually put. We push up? Can you? Uh, okay. Okay, you don't have enough. <laughs> you actually need. Yeah, you you actually need to be kind of fast, I guess. <clears throat> God, get him off me! What? 
is start here. Why would he try to fire us? They should just ditch it. Shit, more guards coming out of that train Get that oh, at the end of this. Still standing. All these bastards must be guarding something. Need to hide the back, right? Yep. He's pushing on. My head. Can I get back my head? I I can't see. Is our friend coming? Does looting even, you know, that useful anyway? I lose my head, man. We don't have time to play games. I'm just looting. I'm not playing games. Finding my head. How do I get there? Come on. Where's my head? Where the fuck is my head? You just lose your head? I want my head. Oh, my head is gone. Oh, is that my horse? Mm. So this is empty though. If before there's like no Oh it's oh that's my head. Wait it doesn't show it on the map? My head doesn't show on the map. Oh come on, give me give me the head. I I want I want my head. Ah. Nice. Wait, is that my head? Or is that just a random head? Huh. Hmm. 
Where the hell is the guy that I can loot? Well, I mean, I don't need to loot everything, I guess. A lot of people have the wedding ring. But uh, yeah, apparently <laughs> this is the... A world where Q will be killed. It's not like you have a pacifist option. Are you blocking me? Oh fuck off, stop blocking me. Yes, let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We Five, opening this door. Four, three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up a little. Oh. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door. Oh. Now it don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Now light the fuse. They're gonna have yeah, something's gonna go wrong. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. All right, come on. Just walk on out here. <laughs> we don't want to kill you. My oh we just want to rob your boss. Get on up there. Search that train. Shouldn't you like check to see if they have weapons? You know? Look at this place. <laughs> it's like a palace. Well, now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? Go I'll search the rest. Train. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some. Oh, they they're you? talking in the background too. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see you rushing to jump on that train. He's keen. I'll give you that. Uh, there is a call. Uh, we're yet to receive payment for the two thousand phase explosion of Indian reservation and embryo as agreed a contract between Cobo. Ah. Date. See? Uh, we see where the funds. Uh, we'll pursue a phase two and three of the projects, right, and present thanks, you uh, with a detailed report. Yeah. Make yourself useful. At least we all know you can read. <laughs> Give me those. Wait, what? I I I want to flip it. Invoices. So. Blah blah blah. You got anything? Not really. Sugar imports from the Spanish West Indies. A lot of sugar. Some 
Yeah, it, it doesn't pause when you read. Think of a telegram and for our continued interest in the Jameson Mining Company. However, any news you have received of mismanagement or financial difficulties at the time in Ansberg, Ansberg are simply fake and I would urge you to question your scouts. Sources. The coal industry is quite different from yet. the oil industry in a Let's number of ways. So I certainly remain open yeah, business. Meeting at your convenience to exchange ideas and educate each other on a receptive area, respective areas of corporate experience. I would also be delighted to host you in uh, Ennisburg and give you a personal tour of the mine and its associated facility. Look for a course of correspondence. Can I read the notes? You know? Yeah, of course you can't say again. Anyway, I need to look out the window. Even though my eyes are getting better, I don't want my eyes to start burning again. So, even if my eye is not feeling comfortable, I should still look out the window once in a while. You know? Yeah, I don't even need to use that much eye drop now. Now that, yeah. All it takes is lock out the window more and sleep a little bit longer, like 15 to 20 minutes. Because I, I'm like slowly pushing my sleep schedule later and later because I just don't want to sleep. But yeah, my eyes just start hurting. But now I, I, I push, push the sleep schedule further earlier and then lock out the window more basically. And it, it improves. So I suggest you do the same. Uh, can I, like, watch the thing again, though? Challenges. Challenge lot. Gambler. Herbalist. Oh, friend. Oh, these are. Oh, what? Taco Chappies. Q3 in the same that I use. Oh. Catch and hugging with 40. We're in 45. What? Wow. Yeah, I don't really care about this. These are for the high skill player, I guess, have a challenge to do, but I just want to go through the story. Suga? <laughs> no, this looks like something. A bomb inside. How much is that? Born. I think I got him. Nice. Well, thank God. Come on. <clears throat> yes, sometimes you use E, sometimes you use R. Horse card. Ooh, 25. Yeah, that's. You need a lot of. You have a lot of horse cards you can collect, but sometimes it's, it, it takes time thing. It's time sensitive, so you cannot search what did you find? freely. Bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? Huh. What do you think? 
I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. I am doing all the work, as usual. Okay, get on the train, quick, all of you. Any bright ideas, I kill all three. So behave. Come on, move. We won't tell a soul, I swear. Go on. <laughs> they are gonna send people after us, but. You know, such is life. Wait, can I start searching again now? Wait, it opens. Oh, this is the first car we begin. Okay. Also, how can I see my own horse car? Honest friend, profound concern about what happened next. Found a girl, woman who was safe, husband, okay. There's still a lot of dead bodies here. J is journalist. I mean journal. Hmm. Yeah, you, you most of the time you can't save. Is this weird in my head though? Chocolate bar. Beacons. Health cure. Oh, so these are health cure, and then these are. Okay. Fully we saw that eye. Oh, right. How do you do that eye? Interesting. If they blow up the cha train, then they are not going to start the train again, though, right? Shouldn't they just t you 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 like tie them up and? Make sure they, they are not gonna jump off the train or something. Oh, hi, wow. Oh, 
overview progression level three. Examiner eight. Perfect. Eating too much or too little will make you become overweight or underweight. If you're overweight, stamina will be affected negatively and health will improve. If you're underweight, health will improve negatively and stamina will. Wow! Insane! Insane! Can you like look at the other stats? No. Map player. Author. Horse. General. Temperature fair. Order. Core drain rate. Oh, okay. Core time remaining. Wow. Deadline. Don't even know what deadline does. Huh. Your data attribute determines how long you can active your dead eye state. What even is dead eye? What what even is dead eye? Is that just aim down sights or something? Unlocking special equipment. Well, it's up by my head. So we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. Well then, let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. Arthur is like just working for the gang. He's nice to the gang. As long as it's for the gang, Ava is gonna do it. Get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me? With the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. Not me, for the first time.
Oh, you still need to control it. <laughs> Oh, the wheel looks like the wheel looks like it's breaking. Yeah. Okay. Let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wagon? Shut up. I'm just saying. Don't say less. Pick the wheel up. <laughs> Nearly there. There. See? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. Oh, shit. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on. Let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Huh. They're just watching. Fire now. Stay on this trail. We'll follow the river, then cut left inland. Yeah. So, yes. The Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. They lost it all. Stolen clean away from them, it was. Every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't. Spider Duchess talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our blockheaded driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds wow, I thought fancy, he's gonna crash. He knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. <laughs> so. What happened to your trap? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did. But when we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. Oh, life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Make sure you wear clothes appropriate for them. What? How do I change clothes then? He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. How how do you change clothes then? Honor. How the fuck do I? Change clothes. <laughs> Round thirteen, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait. I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. Yeah. We still heading the right way? That depends. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we planned? No. 
Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law, eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here. Oh, dear. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls. Our kind of place. Driscoll's? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait. What's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? It's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him. But we kept telling him that ferry job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. It's the way it is. Always has been. Why are you only like whipping Dutch, one of the horse? We've all been in this line of work a long time, and we're still here, so I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. What happens if you go the wrong way, though? What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. Doing this on a bumpy row, huh? My eyes closed. Oh, okay, thank you. Doing this on a bumpy row is like bad idea. Oh damn! I thought. <laughs> I thought we were gonna crash. What what happened if we crash though? Compodium track what you have you discovered in the world. Head in there, follow the tracks for a bit. Thanks. Hey, slow up. I'll jump on. Yeah, look at the track. The details are so. Who is this guy anyway? Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. Do you say home sweet home when you enter a new home? This place is perfect. Well, I guess you can. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now, it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Jose. Every last one of us. How many but did I you kept make? Us huh? Together, kept us alive, kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck, east of the Grizzlies, and out of money, and a long way from our dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother. But we are safe. We make a bit of money here, then we move again, head out around them. Be west of Uncle Sam in a few months. Buy some land. I hope so. <laughs> Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know <clears throat> things have been tough, but we are <clears throat> safe now. Where is the we widow? Are too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, 
Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you. Do it properly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're gonna start a forest fire. Horse shoe overlook. A couple of weeks later, back in the mud. Got off the mountain, rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartlands. Ain't been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more, and I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier. In spite of black water and that whole mess. Yeah, new clothes. I think. Jose. Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> Copium updated. <laughs> Compendium. Yeah. Morning. Molly. Hi. You can antagonize? What's wrong? Thought you'd be happy to be off that mountain. Oh, I don't know. You ain't been yourself for a while. That's anyway, it. Anyway, I won't disturb you. Well, I'm not much company. Take care. Beautiful lady, though. So, you and Lenny didn't see no trouble when you scouted ahead? Nothing too much. No Pinkertons, anyway. Why would you want to antagonize them? Other is good people. Why would you. Why would you You're antagonize? Right the place. Good spot. You'll do for now. For sure. Well, I should get back to it. All right, Arthur. What about the widow? Hey, Strauss. Good morning. Keep those books full now. I'm trying. Medic, huh? Wait. Oh, Arthur, my boy. My dear boy. What's going on? Nothing. Nothing at all. For the first time in weeks. Nothing. We're free. We're free to plan our own futures once more. I hope so, Dutch. You kept the faith, Arthur. You always kept it. And I ain't losing it now. Okay, bathroom time. Be right back. Whoops.
Hey. Hello. Be back. Okay, let's see the ladies. I'm a lady person. Uh, so what is my mission anyway? What even is the mission there? Come on. Mm, good one, boy. Poor Bowser didn't speak well. Freeze him a little. I'm going to feel a little happy. Okay, save game. But, uh, progress or something? It's still chapter one. Uh, Kabru is six minutes. Pick up an entering horse. Oh, okay. What? That's it? Save Lenny when he's hanging. You can just not save. After stopping the train, take out the guards within 1 minute 30 seconds. Take no damage. Get 10 headshots. Complete the mission without taking any health items. Without taking any. Not using. Taking. Damn. But what is my current mission though? Do I need to do everything? Ah. Can I choose to. Oh, prisoner. Curious. <laughs> right. My name ain't no concern of yours. I'm hungry. I don't give a damn. Huh. You seem like a decent fella behind it all. Then you ain't a good judge of character. <laughs> yeah, well, we'll leave it there now. Can I actually give him food though? No? Okay. Cruel bastard. Cutting me up right by the food. Or? Oh, soup. What's the money thing? Contribute. Oh, okay. <laughs> Butcher. Where are the other ladies? I want to talk to the ladies. Wait, save? Or shave? Trim. Oh my god, okay. All facial here. Length. Oh, you can grow your beard. I don't really like mustache.
you need to wait for them to grow for for bad for for longer well, i guess interesting who the fuck is this Spring Ross, Morgan, Beatrice Morgan, okay. Oh, is this the... No, I don't think so, right? Nothing to read. What's this? What? First bank robbery newspaper scrap. <laughs> Three men shot. In a cashier at the banking house of Lee and White. Largest big stolen young man vanish. Firearm. Yeah, whatever. Why is that a like exploitation mark there? Don't really feel like we are hidden. This is as hidden as we're gonna get. Unless you wanna live in a cave. We might be less doomed if you pitched in and did some work. Christ, Arthur. I nearly died. Oh, you're not you're not know. nearly die now you you're not nearly die now okay I'll catch you later then uh -huh. hi lady finally a lady good morning Arthur you okay there Tilly Tilly I'm okay warm at least could do with getting out of here for a bit I'm sure okay well let's talk more later okay Oh, the kid. So you like the new camp, Jack? Sure. It's fine. It'll do us for now. All right, well, I should be getting on. Let me know if you find candy. Oh, are you still sad, lady? I is that her? Is that the widow? Yeah. I just wanted to say I'm sorry about your husband, your home. He was worth a hundred of you thieves and murderers. I have no doubt. You're still mad? You, you're still mad at us? Well, I should get back to it. Alright, Arthur. How are you still mad at me? I mean, yeah, you get robbed, but we're kind of... We're kind of the robbers who save you from the other robbers. So... <laughs> Yeah, at least thank us for saving your life <laughs> instead of, you know, like enslaving you. Oh well. What do you think of this place, Susan? An improvement on the last, that's for sure. Well, that ain't too hard. Okay, well, let's talk more later. We'll see you later. Please don't hurt me. What do you think of your new home? Let me go now, please. No can do. Ah! 
Hey, another lady. Hi. Good morning. You okay, Abigail? Settling in. Good. All right, well, I should be getting on. All right then, Arthur. Hey, Arthur. All quiet, Jose. Thankfully, yes. Good. Did you and Micah see anything when you rode ahead? Nothing we need to worry about. Okay, good. Well, I should get back to it. Okay. So I guess you have like three... Location then? Yeah, good boy. Well, you can see it. Here, wait. What is what is what this, doing? Uncle? Ow, ow, ow. Careful not to work yourself to death, there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. So while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Well, it's a Strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Do you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out. Sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses already. If you gonna take the old man into town, you can take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Man, we Karen's best. about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> well, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin. You're worried about house chores. Let's go. Do we get a foursome, though? Fair enough. You got me. Come on in. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment to civilization. <laughs> you ladies are going to love it. Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Out through the trees here, then take a look. Those two girl looks like uh, they are sisters, right? Because they are. They even have the mole in the same spot around their lips. Look out! Who, who is that guy? Friendly? Look at that Koji. He's all over the place. Oh. Is one of you gonna get that fella's horse? Well, I got lumbago. It's very serious. All right, I'll see what's going on. Lumbago, really? You all right there, friend? Oh, hey, you couldn't help me get my other horse back from over there, could you? Whoa, easy. Whoa, now, easy. Uh -huh. 
Stati. Easy, you're all right. Can I get a reward for that? And before a train comes in, <laughs> kill, kill me and the horse. Gentlemen, sir. A gentleman. No, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. <laughs> well, anyway, thank you. That's a good thing. <laughs> we impressed the ladies. Hi, ladies. We're going to talk. Fairy godmother there, Arthur. What's that supposed to mean? It means you got a heart. A small one, perhaps, hidden deep inside, but a real one? And you haven't, your pulse of old lizard. Well, lizards have hearts. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. To be honest, if you not hadn't been here, I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> well, you did. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey! <laughs> oh, very funny. This looks like a decent little town. Other people, finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. Or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. Okay. Take a good look. Oh, they're locked. See what we got here. A lot of the town is locked. Drugs, sheriff. Sure, you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. Yeah, that's a young man's game. Ooh, yes, we can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. Let's park up down the end there, near the stables. All right, here we are, just like I said, the cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man at its finest. Uncle, what are we doing? Well, we're going to do what any self-respecting maniac does. Put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the salute. Okay, just stay out of trouble and don't get yourselves noticed. I, to recall right, I need that to myself. get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Come on, ladies. Imagine we're in Paris. Come on. So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. Insane. Why. What's that, Pete House? You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Why why does he always use my full name? You're my favorite parasite. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm. Right, look out the window. Don't forget to do that. You don't want your eye to start burning before you start doing these eyes exercise. Well, maybe not eyes exercise, you just relax your eyes once in a while, you know, like every half an hour to 45 minutes. Then rats with the plague, then you. Shut up. It's the place now, come on. Morning. 
So, what do you need? Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. You know, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Always thinking ahead, ain't you? You're looking a bit tired there, Arthur. Why don't you pick up some coffee while we're here? Full stock list in the catalog here on the counter. Whiskey's on the top shelf. Here's the door. Sale. Browse catalog. You not getting anything, Arthur? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. Efficient. Dry liquor, tobacco. So, you're actually buying for once? Are you feeling all right? See this? Young folk got no respect for their elders no more. What do you reckon? The lamb or the sausage? Well, this here's a sheep town. The lamb's the best in the state. Now I know what the smell is. <laughs> well, that's a What's rusty that hair right? toting? The ingredients will rage with hair and face and hair growth. Oh. Only three. It's all done. Thank you kindly. Ah, <laughs> this should do the trick. Yep, that's fine whiskey. Do not put your dog down. That should do us. Let's go wait for them outside. Arrows. Gun oil. Oh, okay. Pocket watch. Oh, that too. I think I pick up a watch too. Do not be cruel to your horse. Horse, revive horse from severe injury. Fortifies momentary, moderately. Oh, outfits. Oh, damn. But that's like expensive as fuck. Yeah, we don't know how these heads look, though. Oh well. Coat. Huh. Pants. Gloves, suspender. What? These are cra- Oh, okay. Sell or sell. Interesting. Can you look at the clothes? No. Yeah, this is like kind of weirdest thing. I can I do the 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 the, the oil? 
wanted to grow faster thing. Where's my hair tonic? Uh, health stamina. How do I use the what's it called? How do I open the backpack? How how, how do you open backpack? Uh, pressing a hold down right on the T D pad. D pad. Fuck this. Press and hold the right on your D pad. Stop telling me D pad. You fuck this. Oh. So so stupid. Ah, uh, what's it called again? Hair tonic. It is just called hair tonic. It is just called hair tonic. It doesn't have the air tonic though. Miracle tonic. Fine brandy. What? How do you use a hair tonic then? I. How the fuck do you use? How the fuck do you use hair tonic? Open your sketch. Oh. Stop saying on the D pad. Right on the deep head, like oh, so annoying. Right on the deep head, what is it? What is it called? So and the sensitivity is actually decent. Well you cannot map the, the, the buttons mouse more raw input. Oh key mapping. 
interact feed message. Interact mount block behind cycle camera. Open map. Stealth jump on horse. Wagons. Headlight. Aim in the air. Melee block. Grapple, dead eye. Uh huh. Extra lot on. How the fuck? Oh, is that? No, I don't think so. Cancel. Extra options. I don't... <sighs> For fuck's sake. Some work. You hold it to the okay. Compass off expand. In the kid section, or etc. How do you open sketch? B. Okay, is B. Oh, okay. Good. How long does it last? Or do you just keep drinking? Oh, here's to your good health, sir. <laughs> and to being down here off that mountain. Absolutely. It's a funny world, you know. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house, <clears throat> acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Dene and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out in there, New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real cool. Go rob them. There. Sounds good. Uh -huh. Where's Tilly and Karen? I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? It seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll they are in trouble. in trouble. They are in trouble. There's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Excuse me. Get your hands off me. You thought I wouldn't find you, Tilly. You huh? can go kiss a damn snake for all I care. Get off me. Get off of me. 
I've been looking too long. Get your hands off of her. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get the hell off of her, you son of a bitch. Hey. Hey, take it easy. There's no problem here. There will be if you don't get out of here right now. You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with you right now. Go away with Uncle and Mary. this guy? Across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. Okay, so what kind of trouble is the other girl Uncle, gonna be in there? Look after her. I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. Hotel, huh? What about the? Uh... Oh, what? What the? F okay. Okay. <laughs> what? I did. Okay. You thought I wouldn't find you, Tilly. Huh? You can go get the damn snake for all I care. Get off me! Get off of me! Get your hands off mm. her, friend. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get off her. <laughs> or what exactly? You want to find out? You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. That's not a lot different. Doing this with you Go right away with now. Uncle and Mary Beth. She's They're across right. the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. What was that all about? Just someone I used to know. Uncle! Look after her! I don't Uncle think she's telling the truth. Don't think she she's telling the whole truth. I are you serious? Ugh. That's not a lot of freedom. That's not a lot of freedom. Get your hands off her, friend. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get off her. <laughs> or what exactly? You want to find out? You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with you. Go away right with now. Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. What was that all about? Just someone I used to know. Uncle! Look after her! I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. Hey, lady. We can't talk to her, huh? And she's blocking. Can I help you, sir? I'm looking for a girl who came in here earlier with a drunk feather. Mid 20s, blonde. You'd remember her. Yeah, they're in 2B upstairs. 2B? You, uh, a friend of his? A friend of hers. Like I said, as far as I know, they're in 2B. Who is robbing who then? Oh. That's not very nice of you. Yeah. Nothing. Nothing to worry about. Just men. But stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. Bank? Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but this is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. 
Okay. Keep investigating. I will. I mean, there are a bunch of robbers and corn artists, so. I hope uh, everything's okay up there. After you. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched uh, me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. Yeah. All right, now. Hey, who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? Oh, no. no. Impossible. Listen, buddy, come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Cool. Get. I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. Shit, no! Hey, Just borrowing it. You stay away from me! Get back here, right now! Man from Blackwater. Ow! I don't mean to. Oh well. Telling lies about me? No, no, I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now please help me up. I ain't never been in black water. Then why are you chasing me? I've got an unfortunate face. Yes, yes, me too. Now please pull me up, please, please. All right, come on. You okay, partner? You gained honor. No. no, I am not. I'm a mess. Well, you ain't dead. There is that. Give me Brooks. I think it's best for both of us if we pretend this never happened. Well, I agree. You saved my life. You're a good man, and I, uh, here, you want a pen? It's one of them steel ones. Wow. Wow. Very kind of you. <laughs> but I'm not a good man, Jimmy Brooks. Not usually. You see, I was in Blackwater. I killed people. And maybe I should have killed you. Should I have killed you, Jimmy Brooks? Me? I never saw you. Not, not now, not, not never. Clever, man. I think we have an understanding. Clever, man. Of course we do. Jimmy Brooks. <laughs> I will remember that. I've got a good memory. I haven't. I haven't. Not, not one lick. Not one cent. In this year old mind. Come on. Polite. Okay. Have a nice mission brief. Play? What do you mean we play? Is there a new list of gang killing? Come his over. Return the last word and pause the song. Find Ken within 45 seconds. Oh, what? Yeah, whatever. Come on, the girl. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, I know I would gain honor, but you don't need to tell me that. 
The horse I don't have a saddle on it. The equipment I stole in the saddle. Mister? That's... That's the horse, right? Did I, did I crash into someone and kill them though? Where is the... Hey, look, there must I be some the confusion. I fought for you. at Sylvia's Saloon back in 76. Just a lot of bunk, Plato. It's just a lot of bunk. It's not bunk, Mr. Calloway, sir. It's history. Ancient history. Done and dusted. The dead got off lucky. The living got to keep suffering. Same as always. But did you shoot the Newton twins? I don't give a pig's penis about the Newton twins. One of them was a girl, anyhow. But you had been friends back in 73. You rode the Alabaster Trail together. Funny thing about pigs' penises, they're curly like their tails. <laughs> Put that in your fucking book, Plato. <sighs> this isn't going very well. Apparently not. This is Jim Boy Calloway. The Jim Boy Calloway. Who? The gunslinger. Fastest left-handed draw that ever drew breath. He once killed 14 men in a fight at Lucy Hollow. What are you waiting for? How do you mean? Well, I reckon right now, kill him yourself. I don't want to kill him. I want to deify him. He's a god. I'm trying to write his biography. How's that going? I think I prefer the duel. Either I'd kill him and be able to be Baltimore's finest ever gunslinger, or he'd kill me and I could be set free from ever having to speak to him again. Well, you're starting to understand something very important. What's that? The joys of gunslinging. It's win-win. Freedom or glory. That's brilliant. I'm gonna write that down, if I may. Be my guest. <laughs> What's your name? I don't have a name. But you are a gunslinger. Not really. I mean, folks who need shooting, I try and shoot in the back. All that other stuff, it's, well, bunk. But you fought duels. Once upon a time, I may have. And you ain't interested in fame. <sighs> I don't think so. Strange. But you like fortune. I need money, sure. OK. Then forgive me, mister, if I seem a little desperate. I am a little desperate. This book, I've got to make a thing of it, and, well, there's a whole list. Whoops. Stupid controller. The gunfighters. Legends, every last one. Emmett Granger. Flacco Hernandez. Billy Midnight. Black Bell. Never heard of them. Maybe you can go and speak to them. Ask them about Callaway. Any of them get uppity. Shoot them. I can't believe I just said that, but... You want me to go and find some sad, deluded fools like him, ask if he was the greatest, and then if they get uppity, shoot him? It does sound a lot worse than it did in my head. How much you paying? Well, a lot. Half the proceeds of the book, if you help me get it written. I'll see what I can do. Ha! Oh, get photos. Okay. And there are notes on the back of those portraits that should lead you to him. I'll see what I can find out. I imagine we'll be stuck here upon your return. Here are some other flop house. What? Oh, I pay for the yeah, okay. But can you look at that? Can you look at that? 
Can you... Huh. But... How the fuck do I keep track on the missions? Cigarette cards. Horsey. <laughs> How do you... Uh, once a neutral situation is possible, hit left on your deep. <sighs> uh, open your task slot by pressing L. Yeah, okay. Ah. Can I see the photos and stuff? Master Hunter. Oh. How do we turn the horse? How how do I we turn the horse? Where is the horse to return? You've been the cause of enough sorrow around here. I Let me get through. Good to see you back. Who who is saying that? Is it this guy? Never too soon, huh? B. Okay. Thank you. Keep it moving. Wait, where are where are the ladies and stuff? Are they inside? Always. On the other side, okay. What does that mean? Evening. What, what does this mean? This is our man. You a bounty hunter, mister? Maybe. 
It depends. Put on this snake oil. I'm guessing you ain't here to pass the day, turn yourself in, or discuss the finer points of county law. Then I don't need to know much more than that until I got a reason to. All right. You smell that? This here's a livestock town, mister. Attracts delinquents and reprobates like flies. Now, I'm not a fella to pass a quick judgment, but I've been around long enough to know you don't hire a saint to catch a sinner. You bring me what I need, and I'll pay you well, and I won't ask no questions. So, what is it you need? Why don't you have a look at that poster on the wall over there? He's a low-down huckster. He's been poisoning folks with his miracle cure from here to Ansburg. Killed more than Landon Ricketts without even pulling a trigger. Gets some kind of sick satisfaction out of it. The feller over at the saloon says he thought he saw him by the gorge straight north of here. You think you can bring him in? The money's good. I need him alive, though. I want to make sure the women he witted get compensated before he swings. I'll see what I can do. Well, good luck to you. Hmm. I'm going to That's an important point. Alive. I got it. North. Do I use this then? Wait, how far away is that? Pretty far. For Christ's sake. Uh, horsey is too far. Oh, horsey is... Yeah, horsey is too far. Eh... Uh, how, how long do you need to run then? Stamina is gonna suffer though. You're running kind of fast without using stamina. Using stamina is not that much faster. And it's turning dark and it doesn't seem good. So. Wait, where's my binocular? Mm. I don't have a binocular. I don't see nobody here. Maybe it's a good thing that it's turning dark.
I don't see nobody here. Oh, hey. I see. Oh shit, I'm... Fucked. Shit. Uh, only some of them, huh? Slightly we still have coins them in the core. Really we still all horse horse. Yeah, I guess eat that then. Can I like, shoot his leg or something? Huh. What we got here? Confront. Okay. Benedict Albright. Oh, sir? Hmm. Kind of look like him. And I was told he'd be up here. No, uh, not me, sir. It's because I want to buy some medicine. And I heard, uh, I heard good things. I'll pay in gold. If you could help me find him. It's just... My mother's real sick. Oh, well, if that's the case, if it's for a sick woman, I'd be happy to help. I'm a healer, you know? Corn him. <laughs> Finest medicine yeah. in the state. <laughs> Corn him. Game's over, mister. Put your hands up. I'm taking you in. Taking me in? What for? Apparently that stuff you're pushing is killing folk. There's a price on your head. I don't know. It ain't my business. Come on, partner. That's crap. I'm a healer. I got an aura. I speak to spirits. I'm a scientist. Folks uh, okay. For no good reason. This, Can you pick this is a mistake. one lie hands up, and stick with it? They Just pick one lie person. and stick with it. I have to insist that this is a mistake. Don't be a fool. Wait. Hold on. I'm slipping. Shit. Oh, shit. He dead? What? Oh no. Okay, another horse. Hmm, interesting. Does they even work? Uh, 
Can you go? Okay, that that's it's too hot to What? Well, how are you? Okay, I don't know. Okay, that's. How fucking far is that? How do I? Why do you release it? Press F. Oh, okay. Who made you God, I'm not made God. Judge. I'm only in it for the money. Yeah, exactly. I'm sure it does seem that way. Exactly. Alright. Let's take you in. Look. So, what do you got? Two bucks? Wow. That's. Oh wow. Oh the horse actually will spawn, huh? Nice. Whoops. You're not even tying him up on the... On the... <laughs> You're not even... He's gonna fall off. He's gonna fall off, man. Seem to keep blacking out. Yeah, good girl. Hey, you're okay, girl. Oh, sir, this isn't necessary. I'm a medical man, a healer. 
It's all just a big mistake. Oh, I don't feel very well. I told you to shut up. Well, who made you judge? <laughs> I'm not the judge. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I don't feel well at all. You I'm just here for the sir. money. Oh, my lord. I wasn't expecting you back so soon. Uh, Mrs. Caldor, is uh, just leaving. Sure. Where you want him? He's selling the... <coughs> oh, there's been some terrible mistake. I never did it. Any of it. I thought I told you to shut up, partner. Oh, no. oh, but I told but you... But nothing. Shut up. And, uh, good luck. Oh. It's been real fun. You ain't much of a man. You oh, it's a lady. You remember this partner? Is it one of the widow? Now, sure. Um, how much was you offering? Uh, fifty dollars. Here. Thank you, madam. Uh, please remember what I told you. But that's it. We don't even get to talk to the lady. Soft from falling on the oh damn, <laughs> damn. Wow. Okay, I'm not great, I guess. Sir, I thought I'd stop by to see you. You've seen the air of your ways, I hope. You've been very good at that, I'm afraid. They're gonna hang me. Please. Clumsiness ain't a crime. Get off me! Save your sweet talk for the hanging judge, Mr. Albright. Can't talk to the lady. I'm giving you one last chance. You take Look where you're walking. Nice. Okay, I think that's about time today. Well, interesting so far. Fairy cowboy. Fairy cowboy. So, um, yeah. very interesting so far well anyway thank you for joining and i'm gonna continue next time so good morning good night have a nice day and goodbye and it quit the desktop okay never mind